guys, welcome back to my channel. I am so happy to be filming again. I have missed planning and filming so, so much. I haven't planned for almost a month, which really kills me inside. Well, I've planned, like I've used my planner. Um, I've been using my planner. I just, all my spreads have been planned since like the beginning of April, since actually that week. So all the spreads after that have had already been done, which kind of takes half the fun out of it. Um, but yeah, I'm going to plan today with this kit from It's Just Paper Co. I think it's called something like Floral Serenity or something. I don't know if it's still in her shop. I will link it down below if it still is. I bought this a while back when she was having a sale because I thought it was really, really pretty and that I wanted it. So yeah, um, I'm just going to plan with this kit this week. I don't have much to do this week, um, to be quite honest. I am not doing much. I'm out of school, which is awesome. I am done school until September, which I am so incredibly happy about. I, like, don't take me wrong. I love school. I love learning. I love, you know, just the whole experience of it, but the past session I have been just so tired all the time and especially going to school and working a lot like I have been doing takes a lot of energy out of you. And so I just have been really, really tired and I am just really thankful to have a break and I think that it will be great not only to be able to enjoy the summer but also just to like recuperate and really be able to rest until I go back to school so yeah kind of what's going on right now I am super duper happy though I'm really glad to be out. I only have one year left until I get my bachelor's, which is just so crazy and so, I don't know, like unbelievable to me because I am only 21, uh, 20 actually, as of now, I will be 21 when I get my degree, which is kind of, I don't know, I mean, tons of people do it, but when you think about it also, like, a lot of people do not do it either. And so, I don't know, it kind of seems whatever to me because most of the people in my life have gone to university and do have more than a bachelor's or are completing their bachelor's right now, but when you think about it, a lot of people don't have any, you know, um, education past high school. And there are still a lot of people that don't even complete their high school education. So it's kind of awesome to me to realize that I'm going to get not only more than a high school education, but that I'm going to get a university degree at a pretty young age, so kind of proud of myself there. <laughs> so I just put down my bottom washi and my uh, heart checklist and going to put the to-do headers right here. Yeah, I don't know if I ever told you guys this maybe maybe not it doesn't really matter um, but most 
not most, but like a lot of people in my family actually work in schools. My mom has been a first grade teacher for, oh God, almost 30 years now. Um, I have an uncle who is a school director. So if any of you lives live in the uh, Toronto or Peterborough area, you might have had my uncle as a director. But um, <laughs> I have aunts that are um, teachers and cousins that are teachers and so kind of runs in the family. So obviously all of those people have a, uh, a degree. Um, but yeah, I don't know, I guess it kind of pushed me to just do it because I never envisioned that I had an option not to do it. But when you stop and think about it, it's kind of cool. So I was calculating, the, I was calculating because I am contemplating, I, I thought I said, I think I told you that I was going to talk to you about more about it when I my mind would be more made up but um my mind isn't completely made up yet to be quite honest it's kind of confusing decided what you want to do for the rest of your life <laughs> I mean for some people it's not and truthfully I envy those people so much because it must be so nice to know what you want to do with your life. Um, I'm not one of those people, to be quite honest. I am completing my bachelor's and I still have no idea what I want to do with my life. Um, so yeah, obviously I'm not one of those people, but um, I'm contemplating maybe following in my family's footsteps and becoming a school teacher. I love children. I've always loved children. I spent most of my um, high school and college years babysitting because I just love children so much. Um, so I am contemplating becoming an elementary school teacher and I was calculating um, the other day in how many years I would be done if I did that and I would be working, I would be done with school in four years. Yeah, so by the time I was 24, I would be done with school and have like my bachelor's in psychology, which I obviously am working on right now, and I would have a bachelor's in education as well. So, I don't know. It's kind of cool to think about sometimes, but kind of scary at the same time because I'm at a point now where, where like I'm studying and it's going great and I'm just... going through what I'm going through but I have no idea like what's done and what's not and I have no idea like exactly when I'm gonna stop so it's kind of scary to me to say that like maybe in three years I won't be going to school anymore because that's the only thing I've known so far so I have a couple of shows but honestly I have no idea which ones are over yet because I haven't been watching any of them because I was studying. So I think Pretty Little Liars is over. I think Shadow Hunters is over as well. I think this week, well, as I'm filming this, so last week for this plan with me, Criminal Minds of the season finale. So I think that's over with. I think Amazing Race is still going on. So I'm just gonna put in Amazing, TV sticker for Amazing Race and then I'm going to put one down for Quantico because I have a feeling that's still going on. I'm not 100% sure but I have a feeling that it's still going on. So I'm going to put it down 
And then once upon a time, I have absolutely no idea. So I'm going to put one down just in case. And if not, well, I won't put it down for next week. I'm going to have to find something to watch once all my shows are off TV because it's going to be sad. Okay. I think, honestly, that's all I have for little things for this week. Um, it's kind of boring, but yeah. So I put a work header down every day just because, because um, there are no little things that come with the kit and I don't have any enough milk trackers in the colors that I want. So I'm just going to track my nails on my sidebar, I think. So I'm just going to put down the little things headers. Um... Yeah, so that's not much, but I don't know what else to put down because honestly, I'm not doing anything more. Pretty much just working and chilling by this point. Like I have some cleaning to do and everything. I have a lot of... Um, I don't know how to say it. Like I have to go through all my things and decide what I'm keeping from the semester that just finished and what I'm letting go of, what books, what notes, what um, papers and blah, blah, blah that I'm keeping um, and just clean the apartment and the bedroom because it's such a mess because neither me or my boyfriend have had time to do much cleaning in the past weeks because we were both over our heads with exams. But now that it's over, we're going to have to get into that. So little things are down. I feel like this is going really quick. Okay, I'm not going to complain about that. So I'm going to put down the, um, these. I have no idea what I'm going to put where. I'm just going to go and do so. So put down the full boxes and it's kind of nice because it's going to give me like a lot of room to play with icons and um, to play with, I don't know, stickers and <laughs> layering and everything like that. So that's going to be kind of fun. I don't want to put this one here because it's going to be too much green. So and I don't want to put another floral either. So I think I'm just going to do the polka dot one. So yeah, that's my um, train of thought right now. I'm just super happy to be done with school and on a four month break. <laughs> it's kind of weird when you say it like that, but it pretty much is a four month break is going to be good for my mental health. And then I'm just going to relax and work and hopefully take it easy and rest so that when I start school back in the fall, I feel good about it and I am ready. Okay, so I have this washi here. I'm gonna try to fill it in from the top and see if I have a feeling that I'm gonna need more than that. Um before I put in my full box, but I'm just gonna try and see uh, my full box. I mean, before I put in my half box. 
because her half box are pretty skinny. Maybe it'll be enough though. We will see. So I'm just gonna fill everything in with washi and put down my half boxes. I am going to try not to talk too much but um, while this is going on because I usually talk a lot in my videos and when I start to edit I like <laughs> don't know what to cut and I just talk the whole time and it's just awful. So I am going to fill all of this in with washi and then I'm going to uh, come back when this is filled in. <laughs> All my half boxes are in, all my things are filled out, so I'm just going to put down the Today headers at the top of every box. I think it looks quite good. And it is kind of nice to see that with what comes in the kit, you can easily adapt it to the Happy Planner without adding any of your own washi or your own anything else. The only thing that I added in from this kit pretty much was the um, the little things, but um, yeah, so it's pretty nice to see that you don't have to add in much and you have enough to fill a happy planner with a no white space spread so that's nice because most times even if you use the full sh uh the full kit you still have to supplement like a few pieces of washi or a few pieces of this here and there so that's kind of nice so this is what it looks like so far I think it looks great I'm going to add in the weekend banner the kits come with two weekend banners um, I'm gonna use this one because it's the one that I like most simply I'm going to try to center it nicely. There you go. Weekend banner is down. Um, trying to figure out if I have anything going on this week. Uh, it's not a payday week. It's not a bill due week. I don't have much to do. I'm gonna work on the sidebar real quick. Real quick. So I'm just going to, oh, it's nice that there's no circle on the sidebar this month. I hadn't realized that, but I do like it very much. I had pulled in some sidebar things from Pretty on Paper Co. I think I'm gonna use this pink one as far as tracking. And for tracking, I usually, um, I can use the reminders. Yeah, that could be good. Reminders could be good. There are a lot of work headers. You could probably have enough for like a whole, like to use them as headers, which is nice if you usually plan with a work section. Um, I don't, I just 
put my work schedule in my little things, but if you do, that's nice to know. There is no meals, which kind of is a little bit annoying to me. Um, I use the personal header for And I'm going to use this uh, blush pink toned one because I usually already used my um, turquoise one. So I'm going to use the blush pink one, which is very nice. Um, 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 um. Oopsies. I would rather she put like a, another full ombre her checklist here that you could use on the sidebar instead of putting like individual strips because I don't really use that but okay. Um, I'm gonna put an Erin sticker. And put down her to buy and to go little um, half boxes in case I have anything to buy or any places to go. Like anytime during the week. And then. I think I'm going to use one of these funny uh, training quotes from Pretty on Paper Co. I love those little training quotes. I think they're hilarious. So I'm just going to use this one that says I'm training for a mi marathon on Netflix because this week is probably going to be my week to catch up on all my shows. So. Pretty much gonna look like I'm training for a marathon on Netflix. And it's just gonna fill up the rest of the space. So, there you go. Perfect. So, this is what it looks like. I am going to turn the camera off, add in all my events, filling what I can. Um, see what I pulled out and put everything down and then I will come back and show you guys. Okay, so I filled everything in. As you can see, I don't have much in because I have no idea what I'm doing. Um, but I will show you what I did fill in. So let me just zoom you guys in a little bit. Okay, so Monday I have a few things. Um, one of my very good friends from college gets back in town um, for the summer and he gets home on the second. So I just marked that in my planner because I'm really excited. And I am excited to see my friends again because most of them are away for school. So it's just nice to have them back in town where I can see them and hang out with them and not just text them. Um, the second is also my dad's birthday. He is turning 59. Oh my god, I cannot believe it. So yeah, uh, I just marked down his birthday. And then I marked that down that I needed to upload this plan with me. Tuesday, I just need to remember to clean my beauty blender as well as my brushes because they are getting pretty gross. Um, by the way, this is from... Paper green stickers as well as the little cupcakes, I think. Let me check. Yeah, paper green stickers. Um, the planner and the watch tape are the planners from Pl Planning Roses. This is from Pretty on Paper Co. This is from Planning Roses. Um, and then the only other thing that I added is this little um, massage appointment thing that from. Anxiety aids that I layered with a flag because 
it was kind of the same color as the background. It was kind of getting lost, so that way it sticks out more. And I just put down that I have an appointment for a massage on the 5th. And I also added the Friday banner from um, Let's Plan It because, let's face it, we all love Friday. So, yeah, this is pretty much all that I have for now. Um, I want to start posting, sorry, I'm going to zoom you guys up a bit. <laughs> I want to start posting my end of the week result on Instagram. I'm just, I want to do it, then I completely forget it. And by the time I think of it, it's like the next Thursday. And I'm like, well, there's no point in doing it now. I'm going to do it next week. And then I just never end up doing it. So <laughs> hopefully this is the week that I'm going to do it. Um, remind me, guys. Remind me. So, because I love showing you guys what it looks like, because obviously, like, there's nothing much here, and it's a lot more fun to see what it looks like with all extra stickers added in, and when you add in your plans and everything, it makes it much more exciting, I think. So, let me just show you what I used. I used all of the full boxes and the half boxes. Most of the washi, there's only two little pieces left over here. The icons and her checklist. I am going to keep the icons because I'm probably going to add them down throughout the week as I get my plans down. There's only this left. I don't think I'm going to keep this just for this. And then there's a bunch of headers left, but honestly, what am I going to do with headers only? So I'm pretty much just going to keep the, um, the icons, so this functional sheet so that I can add in the icons throughout the week with my plans and everything and yeah so that's it for this plan with me this week guys I hope you guys enjoyed and I hope you guys like it as much as I do I will link this kit below if it's still in it's just paper co's shop if not I'm sorry guys um but I bought this a while ago and I really really wanted to use it so I hope you guys enjoy it and I will see you guys in my next video bye guys